Welcome back to Grace for East TV, where we like to talk, but we love to eat. And today we are making breaded lemon pepper salmon, you guys. So easy, fast, and convenient. Let's get it. Here are all our seasons, what we're going to need, you guys, for this simple, quick, easy, but delicious recipe. Onion powder. Cayenne pepper, parsley flakes, lemon pepper seasoning, garlic powder, tonies, old bay, paprika, and some olive oil. And we have some thyme. And here is our fish. The fish has been washed, and now we're going to pat it dry. You pat your fish dry so you can take out that extra moisture. We don't need all that in there, okay? Because we need that season to stick to our fish. Next thing we're going to do, like I said, we're going to pat our salmon dry. And then we're going to cut it so we can braid it, okay? Very simple, very easy, y'all. Pat it dry, get all that extra moisture because we want it not only to taste good, but we want it to look good, you know? Just like some of us, baby. Not only do I look good, but, you know, never mind. The salmon has been patted dry. Now we're going to coat with some olive oil. Coat it with the olive oil, you guys. This so our salmon won't dry out. And this also is going to help our season stick to our fish. There we go. Now we're going to season this baby up. Time to mix up our seasons, okay? This is our Tony's. Then we're going to come with our lemon pepper season. It's a little clumped up. I don't know what's going on, but we're going to fix that. Now, don't put too much of the lemon pepper and the Tony's because they both have salt and you don't need it to be too salty. I like my season to be a mixture of things because I don't want it to be such a bland flavor. Now, that was the cayenne pepper. Now that's the paprika. That's going to get paprika smoke, smoked paprika. That's going to give your fish a nice color. Because paprika don't taste like nothing. We're going to add a little Old Bay. Come in with that garlic powder. Now if this not how you make your fish, that's fine. Or if this not how your grandmama didn't make their fish, that's fine also. But this how I make mine. And we're going to come with some parsley. Now we're going to mix it up. Now that olive oil that we coated, rub your girl down before we put the season on. Not too much, not too hard, y'all. Salmon is a very delicate fish, easy to break off, very delicate. You got to take your time with it, baby. Take your time. Now we're going to come in with our season that we mixed. Now we're going to spread it. Spread it, rub it in. Spread, rub it in. You know how your man be asking you to rub his back? I'm going to need you to treat this fish the same way. Get every little crease. Every little crease. See how beautiful that is? It look good already. Like I said, with your, with your seasonings, be careful. You don't want to overdo it because fish is very easy to over season. If you put a little, you know, you can season it to your liking. You don't have to use everything that I use. Preferably, this is just what I like to use. And this is how it should look. Now we're about to cut it in three. We're going to cut it here, in the middle, right there, so we can bread it. And I'm going to show you guys. See how this looks after I have cut it? Now, basically, the breading is so easy, y'all. 
Now you're just going to crisscross. That's it. Crisscross them together until you get to the bottom, y'all. Crisscross. See? That's all that is. And I can't do hell for nothing, y'all. Woo, y'all ain't gonna lie that salmon with my ass, Brittany. Maybe I lie. That ain't the easy part. But this is what you should have afterwards. This is how it should look. Now, when you transfer this, I'm gonna transfer this. I'm gonna cook this in my oven on 400 degrees. 400 degrees for about 15 to 17 minutes until the consistency and um the everything is to my liking i'm gonna add some broccoli and i'm gonna show you guys what it's gonna look before and the after one more thing y'all if y'all don't remember anything else please be careful when transferring this y'all you're bidding done all this hard work for nothing all right y'all salmon made it safely in the skillet y'all now I'm going to just add me some broccoli. I'm trying to eat semi-cleaner, y'all. Because I've been going ham. Anybody else been extra hungry? Now I'm going to just add this to my skillet. And put it in the oven. All right, looking good, y'all. Now we're going to drizzle our vegetables with a little olive oil and i'm gonna sprinkle a little lemon pepper seasoning on our broccoli as well because that's all we need i try to base mostly my seasoning especially if i'm trying to eat a little cleaner or on a little fast and trying to detox and things like that. I put most of my flavor in my fish. I put most of my flavor in my fish because I try not to intake so much salt. Because I do have high blood pressure and tachycardia. But ain't, that ain't stopping nothing. Now this is our before the oven. Before our oven put it in 400 degrees 17 minutes this is the after look how beautiful y'all y'all i'ma tear this up i'ma tear it up y'all i'ma tear it up and this is the after y'all y'all i'ma tear this up i'm so hungry how beautiful.